All right, Fox News alert now from overseas. Witnesses say tens of thousands on the streets of Tehran at the moment protesting yet again the election of last Friday. The White House has been relatively quiet on the Iran issue. When Ronald White Reagan went to the Brandenburg Gate, uh, he did not say, Mr. Gorbachev, that wall is none of our business. As we have done so many times throughout the history of this nation, uh, I think the American people uh, long for the opportunity to stand up from our people to the people of Iran and say, we are with you in spirit as you stand for free and fair elections. President say, put it in words for him. Well, I, look I, again. I want to. The, the president has the right to draw the line where he chooses to draw it. But I'm I'm someone uh, well, who believes think, that when Ronald Reagan. The, well, you think this is the smart. Yeah, line I, I think when Ronald Reagan, when Ronald Reagan went to the Brandenburg Gate, uh, he did not say, Mr. Gorbachev, that wall is none of our business. Uh, he went to the Brandenburg Gate, and he said, Mr. Gorbachev, tear down this wall. We, we know from people like Natan Sharansky and Alexander Solzhenitsyn that deep in the gulags of the Soviet Union, when Ronald Reagan was willing to call the Soviet Empire the evil empire, it gave encouragement to the people who were fighting tyranny within the Soviet Union. I'd like to see the President of the United States give unqualified, an unqualified message of affirmation and support to those brave Iranians who are taking to the streets on behalf of their own freedom.